morning, so it's like one in the morning. It's a little bit later. Um, it's time for her second dose of her medicine um, and get her wrapped back up, give her some relief on that nipple. You see, we got the cabbage wrap about to get prepped. So I'm going to um, throw some food in there, get her up so that way I can actually um, get her up to wrap her. And I'm noticing that she doesn't like the pad anymore, that she's running a slight fever. So we're just going, what are we going to do? I think we're going to run no pad for just the night to see if it help cool her down for the night. She's not feeling it. And um, yeah, man, we're going to sleep. It's one now, we wake back up like three o'clock. Uh, yeah, take that, take this patch, I mean patch take this a uh, wrap off her and that should be good until about six ish give it two three hours um yeah man we'll hopefully she gets better man so it's wash day little man's about to get washed sky where you at sky sky there you are, hi girl. Look at her. She, it's time for her to get right, man. Uh, yup, it's time to. Me too. You see it, man. It's just rough for everybody in the house. We about to get rest of the camp washed, man. Uh, we got my sky after a good wash, light air dry. We gotta clean her up. We gonna get her trimmed up. Let her face dry out some more. She doesn't like me getting in her face, so it's time to trade her out. A young skizzy. <laughs> Cooking the oil for him, his nose, paws, and everything. Sky's gonna get some too. I think I'm gonna wash Nova, man. I feel bad, like, leaving her out, so I think we're gonna go grab her. Wash her up real quick so I'll get her back to her pups. Uh, might turn the uh, heating pad up a degree or two. Nice and clean. He is coconut oiled up. Yeah. Sky. I kind of clean her up. She doesn't like the steak. Still, not at all. But show them the face is definitely cleaned up. Better than it was. Yeah, we clean. Everybody clean, man. <laughs> Alright, man, it's the next day. We finally got the room clean now, too, as well. Tell them you get clean. Uh, clean, yeah. Look at that back shining. Clean coat. Like to grab all the pups, clean up, pool, wash, throw in the new. Out with the old and with the new. And you know, it's another day in paradise, man. I appreciate y'all for watching. Comment, like, subscribe. I got way more on the way. It's going to be a great year. I appreciate y'all. Ah. What's good, man? We, we in the whip with it. We about to leave the vet. Spend some more money. We got more meds for Nova. Another 10 days. But this one is only one and a half for the next 10 days. And they said she's good. Her, uh, her red and blood, I mean, her red and white blood cell counts are back normal. They aren't high like how they were before. She's getting back how she's supposed to, normal, healthy. She's eating way more, going crazy. So we about to go back to the crib, uh, clean her up a little bit. She was leaking a little bit, a little discharge. Um, and yeah, man, we'll give y'all this two week update on the pups. They got big, man, real quick. Uh, between having to get up to make sure everyone's eating properly and giving her this medicine and work this week, it's been beating my ass. So that's why 
I haven't picked up the camera in a second, but we back, man. Um, yeah, man. Yeah, man. See y'all when we get to the crib. Of course. Damn, I always, the music always serves as I come back on this. What is good, man? We haven't done the update yet. Um, What's up? Sorry. Yeah, man, she happy to be on camera. Look at her. <laughs> Well, we headed to try to supply everybody out of food. Well, almost out of food, so I gotta grab food. I think I'm gonna start to separate the food. Yomi and Scott will eat the same food, and Nova will be on his puppy food until she is done whelping these pups. Um, but yeah, man, update. I gotta do that. I fell asleep, so yeah, we're gonna handle that when we get to the crib. So we're gonna grab the puppy for Nova and then for Sky and Yomi. I really, that has the big pellets. This has the smaller pellets. But they're not really, well, Yomi's athletic, but Sky just, she doesn't do too much. But I don't think it's gonna hurt anything putting her on it large breed they don't need that and then i think this has big pellets as well probably going premium on dope man we about to switch out real quick it is a yellow so miss nova wants to always get out now so I'm about to rearrange somehow, some way. We're gonna figure out how I'm going to use such. Um, Look at them. Yeah. Look at how cute they are. All cuddled up together. And she's just like, boy, what's wrong with y'all? But yeah, we're gonna get them all cleaned up and rearrange because Nova is figuring out a way to move this all around. She just keeps pulling that side out the way. She I see. I be seeing the clips. She be pushing that little black box out the way and that makes it easier for her to move the little gate and then she just be making her escape. <laughs> and then today she wanted to make a mess on the heating pad. Her and her pups, her kids. But um, luckily, it's warming up now, and in here it stays a consistent uh, temperature anyway. I feel like they can regulate themselves. If anything, I feel like I'm gonna be worried about it getting too hot in here. I don't have like AC in this part of the crib, so we'll worry about that as it comes. But right now, I'm about to figure out a better situation for them. It's orange, using the restroom. Like, look how bro looks. He looks like he's strained or something. Is he? I don't know. I really hate this gate. How you have to freaking bend all the way down. Yeah, the two stage is kind of oldie. Yes, these are me and my kids. Nova is starting to get ready for her regular life again. She always hopping out this gate and standing by the door. <laughs> She's so cute. Time for a wash, though, to be honest. Another one. So this is set up, we're gonna end up, I just ended up grabbing all the pieces and closing it off so that way she can't, unless she jumps over, she can't get out anymore because it's closed off. These little guys are yap B. Oh my gosh, like, look at you, you got shit on you. You probably shit on your sister. Jeez Louise, bro. No, they keep, they just keep rummaging through the shit, man. But clean, post y'all up. We are gonna get them weighed and everything for the night. All right, we're about to get everybody weighed. Uh, my official chart has ran out, so I gotta redraw, need something new. 
I'm using this as a clipboard. Uh, we got the scale over here. Let's get into it. I'm gonna give y'all a little update of everybody too. Hopefully they're not too fussy. Um, let's start out with Mr. Red here. I was concerned about him for a while, but look at him. As you can see, he, he's pretty good. He's doing well now. Show them, show them your eyes, man. He just came off the nip. He's not happy. But he's a nice black, solid black. He got a little, does he have chest? Yeah, he has a little chest on him. One of my faves, he, he's a quiet guy. Forty-eight and a half ounces for Mr. Red. So, for example, that's only a half ounce from when I weighed them earlier. Mind you, I weighed them this morning, and it is eleven fifteen at night now. So, not a full day. So, I'm not going to trip too much. We're going to check in on him again tomorrow to make sure he's doing what he's supposed to be doing. Miss Purple is next. She is fussy, but nice Brindo. You see it. She has a, does she have a chest? Nah, she don't got a chest on her. 49. This has gotta be, well, either she lost the ounce, or this is cap. I had 51 this morning, the scale had to be off because now she's 40, 48 and a half. And like I told y'all, she's fussy. Little girl, it is okay. Mr. Blue and Mr. Orange are asleep, so we're gonna skip. We got, yep, Miss Green here, another Brindle. She's on the darkest side. She got white paws, dark chocolate Brindle low key. I'm pretty sure she has, does she? Yeah, she got a little chest on her. Forty-eight ounces, Miss Green. Yeah, um, no, but I think when she got out the cage today, they did not eat properly because everybody is looking to be down. I don't like it. I don't like it. Down. Mr. Lime Green, he is the biggest of the bunch, as you can see. Big boy, big brindle. He has white paws and he's fussy. White. White chest. Sixty four on him. Why he yells so much, I cannot tell you, man. But he gained weight, of course, because he's a bully. Miss Pink here. She's all black with white tips, but she's beautiful. Look at her. Nice black all the way through. She got a little chest on her. Uh, can you see? She doesn't have a chest actually. Fifty-seven. Yeah, everybody lost weight today. So I'm gonna assume it's because mama got out of her cage today, or out of the playpen. Mr. Blue, he's another black. Uh, 
52 and a half from Mr. Blue. Oh, everybody's losing weight today. Mr. Orange, another black. He has white paws, white chest as well. Solid boy. Fifty four and a half. Oh my gosh, he lost like over. He lost about four ounces. So yeah, I think I'm. Uh, it's time to start weaning them off. Um, they're getting big fast, man. 11 pups on one mom is crazy. Mr. Turk. Big boy. Solid boy. All black once again. He got a little white in the tips. He has a little chest on him, white chest. But as you can see, solid. Sixty-three for him. Oh, he's a bully. He lost. He gained three ounces today compared to everybody else. Uh, Mr. Brown, we wet. We wet. We wet. That's what she. Uh, Mr. Brown over here. Mr. Brown is another black boy. He's on the lighter side. He's gonna be like Ma Dukes. He has that brindle in him. And I'll be able to identify the colors better as they grow. Um, let's see. He does not have a chest on him. What a little dot. I need to clean him up real quick. Oh, he's peeing. <laughs> I got my boy stimulated. And he's just going, jeez. Mr. Brown is 50. He didn't lose any weight. Who I got left? I got Mr. Black and Mr. Yellow. So as you can see, this is Miss Yellow. She is feisty and yappy. She is one of the bigger of the bunch. Black Brindle. She's gonna be like Ma Dukes. As you can see, she's kind of. She's black, but when I light hits her, you can see that brown. Very solid. I can't remember if she has, she has a white chest. Big girl. She is 61 and a half. So she gained today. Last but not least, Mr. Black, wherever he is. Mr. Black is fussy. He's all black with white, white paws, tip paws. He needs a little cleaning up. He has a white chest, I'm pretty sure. Yes, sir, Ski Shoto. Uh, he don't want to show y'all, but he's a feisty little guy. He probably gained weight. Fifty-eight. Yup, he gained weight, and I'm pretty sure that is everybody today.
about to get him cleaned up as well. I can't see. See, he's milk drunk now. He, he's good. He about to be quiet. And that could technically, that would be like, I guess you see my stimulation for the day. I got nanny on me, ew. Oh, these, yeah. But, I'm gonna keep rotating everybody out, make sure everybody gets Good eats. We gotta order these bowls tonight so I can start weaning them off. Uh, Dewormer, I'm gonna grab that as well because it is day 17, going on 18 tomorrow morning. So week two, they need that dewormer. Um, but if you watch so far, I appreciate y'all. JB from the three, man. My first experience with the breeding, man. My girl's doing a good job. It's cool, man, it's exciting. It's a lot of work, though. If you think it's easy, it's not. It's going a lot of hours going into this, a lot of money goes into this, the vet bills, the visits, the time, the effort, the, all of the above, man. It, it's a whole lot, but I'm enjoying the process. I'm loving it. Puppies, man, how can you not love them? But once again, Comment, like, subscribe if you watched so far. And I appreciate y'all. I'll see y'all in the next one.